Hi, my name is Chris Martin. I'm here in the American Honda booth at the 2012 SEMA show. We have a great display this year, really focusing on three of our major brands, the Honda brand, the HPD brand, which is our racing brand, and for the first time in the past six years, the Acura brand has returned to our booth. On the Honda side of the booth, we're having a world debut of the HFP kit for the all-new 2013 Honda Accord Coupe. Limited edition 500 kits, it lowers the car, improves handling, you get a wonderful interior accoutrements. And then for the sedan, we've actually brought an example of the X package, which is currently available for sale. Exterior kit for the body, new wheels, some additional accessories are on that car, including lighted door sill trims, which are really, really cool. Moving further along the booth, we have two project cars, one from Busy Moto, who in the past has built some really, really high horsepower Hondas. We also have DSO Eyewear, who built a really super clean touring car out of an Accord sedan. And behind me here in the Honda Performance Development section is the Fit that actually won its class at the SCCA runoffs this year. Directly behind that is a replica of the car that Dario Franchitti drove here in the Indianapolis 500. And beyond that, we have the car that won the ALMS Series Championship this year. The HPD built a further iteration of their CR CRZ concept to really bring performance of the CRZ even higher, but make it into a more realistic street car. In the Acura booth, we actually have the movie car from the Avengers that Tony Stark drove away at the end of the movie. A really awesome supercar concept. We also have an ILX that was built by Team Honda Research West, which is a racing team within Honda R&D, to race at the 25 Hours of Thunder Hill later on this year. The philosophy on this build isn't all about engine mods, it's more about light, weight, and balance. So under the hood, there's an AEM cold air intake and a custom AEM exhaust. As for the exterior modifications, there's a Baja Designs LED lighting that's on top of the hood. The front splitter is a custom one designed and built by THRW, and there's a rear wing by APR. The other 2013 ILX is built by Evasive Motorsports, and the premise behind that was to take an ILX and build it for the street. Because it's a street build, it has modifications suited for daily driving, so it has a CT Engineering Supercharger, a prototype exhaust, and coilovers by Tane. So American Honda is back at SEMA stronger than ever. We've got the all-new Accord, which went on sale and is selling really great this year with great accessories available for it. We've got championship cars left and right coming out of HPD. And with the ILX opening all new doors for the Acura brand, we're really, really excited to show off everything we've got here at the SEMA show.